opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The Sicilian defense controls the d4 square with c-pawn. Nf3 develops the knight toward the center to prepare for a d4 pawn push, where the knight will recapture if black captures on d4. e6 creates an opening for the dark squared bishop and opens a new diagonal for the queen. d4 offers to trade the more important central d4 pawn for the c5 pawn in exchange for more control of the center and quick development. Cx d4 gives black two central pawns versus one central pawn for white. Nx d4 recaptures the pawn and activates the knight in return for having one central pawn versus black's two central pawns. A6 prepares for a b5 pawn push to gain space on the queen side and stops the white pieces from using the b5 square. Nc3 develops the knight, supports the e4 pawn, and controls the d5 square. Qc7 controls the important d6 and e5 squares and keeps white guessing where the black pieces will develop. B2 develops the bishop and prepares castling. This prepares the bishop for development. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade takes back. This activates a piece and simultaneously wins time by attacking an opposing queen. This blocks the attack on a queen that could have been captured. This is the only move that works. This threatens to add pressure on a pinned bishop. It is the last book move. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. This permits the opponent to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is best. This is the way to win a pawn. It is best. Takes back. It is good. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is excellent. This threatens to kick a queen. It is excellent. This challenges the opposing rook for control of the open file. It is excellent. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. It is good. This is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. That was a truly amazing move. This threatens to win a queen. It is brilliant. This move puts the queen on a safer square. This threatens to kick a bishop. It is best. This threatens to kick a knight. It is best. This kicks an opposing bishop. This threatens to win a bishop. It is best. This kicks an opposing knight. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is good. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is good takes back. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This forces the opponent to double their pawns, which weakens their pawn structure. It is best. Recaptures. This is the start of the end game and white is equal. It is best. This threatens to fork pieces. It is best. This blocks the attack on a pawn that could have been captured. This stops the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. The game was close to equal, but now black has the advantage. It is a mistake. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it? It is a miss. 
This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. Right on target. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. That was a free pawn. It is best. This move puts the rook on a safer square. This is the only move that works. This threatens to play checkmate. It is a great move. This stops the opponent from being able to play checkmate. It is best. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This evades the check from the queen. It is forced. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This evades the check from the queen. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. Right on target. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had a nice end game.